So once the embryos have been flushed, uh, France uses a, a specific media that we flush them in. Uh, we then go through with the microscope to find them. So they're a bit too small to see with the, uh, with the normal eye. Uh, once they've been flushed, they go into a special media called holding media. Uh, so I just keep it warm a little bit so the embryos don't get too much of a shock when they come out. Okay, so that's a special media. In that media, fresh embryos can stay for at least 24 hours before we transfer them. They're very happy. There's antibiotics and all kinds of um, things to keep them happy. So then once uh, we find them, I just spot them and pick them up with my pipette. Um, and then they go straight into the holding media, which is being warmed up a little bit, so they still at the same temperature. So once it goes in there, we cool them down to room temperature, and then when we need to transfer them uh, and we need to travel, we can travel up to 12 hours with these embryos in the media. We cool them down even more. We take them to about um, 4 to 5 degrees temperature, and then they stay dormant at that temperature. So when we get to the farm, we just take them out, let them come back to room temperature, transfer them, and then you know they start growing again. And if we freeze them? If you freeze them, the process is different. Once they're frozen, they can stay frozen for years, 20, 30 years if you like. Um, the thawing process is a bit more tricky, that you've got special media that you need to thaw them in, but it's very easy to transfer. And there's photos of two ewes that we've got some from. Uh, so, 227 has... How many embryos you got from one flush? From one flush, she's got 18 embryos. 18 girl. embryos? 18 A grades, yes. And then this one, 19.90, has 19 embryos. From one donor, one flush. Okay, great. Great, thank you.